What is going on ladies and gentlemen, my name is Equalize Espresso and welcome back to another Black Ops 3 video here today on my channel. Today what we got for you guys is some multiplayer talk actually, more specifically talking about some of the perks that we will be seeing returning in Black Ops 3. Now if you guys are new here, be sure to subscribe for the best Call of Duty Black Ops 3 content. If you did like the video, be sure to leave a like rating down below, it really does help the video and the channel out and is greatly appreciated. But, getting right into the talk here, as you guys know we did see a few teasers within the trailer for Black Ops 3 that did relate to the multiplayer not too much but we did get some teasers as well as we got a few glimpses like very few glimpses at zombies so seeing this kind of stuff this early in the year was kind of a surprise a very pleasant one at that but we did have some things confirmed to us here and there but today what we're gonna be talking about are the perks that we know as of right now that are in the game and some that are not in the game now if you guys were not aware the game right now is currently in pre pre alpha so it's the most raw forms of multiplayer the game again mechanics, graphics, and such are already built, but the balancing of weapons, movements, map flows, and all that kind of stuff are still in the works, and they're still being worked on all the way up until probably right after the beta ends in, I think, probably September is my guess on when that will be happening, and then it'll ship for the final build of the game later in October, as well as November, right whenever we actually get it released to us, but the actual alpha stage won't be reached until about late May, maybe early June is my guess, and the beta we won't see again until that is actually released obviously there's that pre beta crossover period but right now what I'm trying to get to is the game is in its most basic raw forms they're still building all of this kind of stuff and determining what all we will be getting returning in black ops 3 now you want to take it over to Twitter Vonderhaar was answering a series of questions initially it was about dead silence that's a big controversy with advanced warfare taking out dead silence and putting it in as just an ability exo mute it was something that wasn't necessarily the biggest hit but all also something that a lot of people adjusted to very easily. Now, I'm upsetting, tweeted to David Vonderhaar, bring back the perk Dead Silence. To which Vonderhaar replied, Dead Silence is a perk currently in perk 3, subject to change the category, not the perk. So, not only is the perk confirmed to be in the game, but it's also confirmed not to be taken out. As I said with a lot of this pre-alpha stuff, it is subject to change and a lot of things are either going to be taken out, added in, and stuff like that. So, it's nice to see that Dead Silence is 100% confirmed to be in the game and stay there as well. That's a great thing for a lot of people and I know a lot of people will definitely be happy about that. Now, it does have some drawbacks because it is considered a must-have perk to a lot of people and will eat up one of your perk 3 slots, assuming that there are wild cards again that you can add another perk onto it, but we can also pretty much assume that there will be some sort of counter perk as well in the perk 3 slot, so that right there is two of them. Now, going back to Twitter, we did see almost a conversation out of this emerge as the biggest teeth tweeted back to this, is toughness coming back, scavenger, lightweight, etc. I asked it around and no one had an answer for scavenger, to which David Vonderhaar replied, toughness out, scavenger in, lightweight, not available, all subject to change, pre-pre-alpha, still working on these systems. And finally, Tim tweeted this conversation, is toughness built in then or completely out? To which Vonderhaar replied, if you are asking me how much flinch exists, it's about one half the amount between having toughness and not in Black Ops 2, subject to change. So that right there is confirmation of even more perks. Scavenger is in, Lightweight is not available at the time, but is subject to be put in the game if necessary. Toughness is out, which is something that a lot of people can definitely be happy about. And then Dead Silence is also confirmed to be in. So right there, that's information on four perks that we have seen previously, and that can be crucial to the game, but yet we have some information to it just in late April. So we do have a lot of time to think about this and a lot of time to continue on finding out more information about multiplayer and the game in general in the next couple of days two weeks to months but that's where we're going to wrap it up today ladies and gentlemen let me just think down there in the comment section down below of these four which of these are you the most happy that are or are not returning in black ops 3 if you like the video be sure to leave a like rating down below any shares your facebook twitter and or myspace if you're a jack that always greatly appreciated if you're new here be sure to subscribe to the best of color to black ops 3 content and any news or fish you guys know exactly where to find it right here on my channel Thank you guys once again so much for watching. My name is Mini Cola Espresso. As always, hope you guys are having a great day. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Take care and peace. Surprise, motherfucker.